Okay, hey guys, I'm sorry that y'all are not going to be able to see me in this vlog. Um, <laughs> I'm not hiding from y'all. I'm just, <laughs> I just wanted to try a different type of video this time around. Um, yeah, and it involves me not really showing my face. It, it involves me working on my angles and working on me. Um, it, 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 it requires me to work on my angles and to work on my voiceover uh, skills and also me adding like some type of music in the background so I hope you guys can hear me I am going to be talking loud before we get started um, I do want to just do the intro hey my babies welcome back to my channel it's your girl Raya J and I'm back with another video my babies um, I hope we all are continuing to stay about happiness peace and love and I hope we all are continuing to stay determined, motivated, and focused. And I hope we all are continuing to walk in the alignment of stars that Allah has for us. So you already know what this video is about because you clicked on the video, you clicked on the title. So yeah, let's get straight into it. Right here, I have my my um, my pan and I'm going to be cooking my salmon in this pan. I just rinsed it. So now I'm going to rinse my salmon. This is the salmon that I'm going to be using. Let me try to move that over so i can show y'all so i just got it from the supermarket this is just some um I'm trying to show hold on y'all hold on i think i'm gonna have to move the pan so yeah here we go here we go where we at 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 where we at, where we at? Where we at? Where we at? so yeah as you can see this is atlantic salmon This is Atlantic Salmon Fillet, farm raised in Canada. It was only $7.49. So now let's get back to our pan. Let's move this because I feel like this is kind of making my video look a bit ugly. <laughs> so um, let's fix the angle again. Yeah, that's perfect right there. Okay, so I'm gonna turn my pan on low. I'm gonna rinse my salmon. First, what you need to do is drizzle a little bit of olive oil on your pan. Let me take this roll off because I'm getting hot already. And then what you can do next is you can Put some butter in the pan as well. I love a lot of butter, you know, so don't mind me. Okay, we got that going. Uh, I'm going to rinse my salmon. This video, this part of the video, y'all, is basically to show y'all how to make a luxury. <laughs> it is, uh, <laughs> I'm over here looking at the salmon skin. Oh, this video is, I mean, this part of the video, let me focus. I'm over here, I'm everywhere. Put it skin down. See the skin? Put it skin down. This is a nice piece of salmon. Okay. I just want to show y'all how to make a simple luxury, a healthy luxury meal for under $10, y'all. As you can see, the salmon was $7 and change. We also have some canned vegetables for a dollar and change. I got some green beans. And then we also bought some Uncle Ben's brown rice for a dollar and change. I should have took a picture of all the food, but that's okay. So right now I'm gonna be using some Goya Total. Some Goya Total. And sprinkle that on. You can put a lot of this on there because this is literally, it's just herbs. It's just herbs. I do use a little bit of adobo. A little bit. Y'all gonna see me sprinkle it on. A little 
bit of that. Um, and then I'm going to put some Obey. You can't go wrong. When you're cooking seafood, you can't go wrong with a little bit of Obey. You feel me? So let's do a little bit of Obey. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I also like to go in with some minced garlic. We're going to do, let me show you how to do my quick brown rice. As that's cooking, let's turn that flame up a little bit. And now I'm going to put the top, put the top on it. Make sure you put the top on it because that's how you get your salmon to cook all the way through. We're going to see that start bubbling in a little bit. See, you can see it already starting to bubble. Now let's focus on the, the rice. I'm gonna have to hold y'all while we do the rice. So what I like to do first is open up. What you have to do is really, honestly, you have to just squish it. Squish it, squish it, squish it so that it's breaking apart. Um, and then I literally just tear this part right here. And as you can see, the rice is just literally ready. You can heat this up in a microwave. I don't use microwaves. I don't have one. So I just have to heat everything up by my stove and by the oven. So let's go ahead and put this in the pot. So literally just pour it in. Literally. So easy. Then we're going to get us some piece of butter, some butter right here. Let's get us a piece of butter. You don't have to put butter in your rice because you just don't have to, like literally. It's just brown rice. It's gonna go well. Look, nice piece of butter. Let's go ahead and put this in the pan. That's done. Then we are going to find the top that pan and cover it and let it slow cook the rice heats up really quick like i said you can use the microwave if that's your steez it's just not my steez so we put the top on and that is going to be ready to um that's going to be ready in no time actually i'm going to put it on this this one Okay, let's come over here. Let me show you how to spruce up these greens. Have my clean pot. Uh, what I'm doing, I'm gonna open up my can of greens. And then 
drain it out. Drain out your greens. Take your greens, put them in the pot. Clean up your mess. Don't forget to clean up your mess. And now we are going to season up our greens. You want them to be luxurious as possible. So what I like to do is I like to go in with some butter. Let's go in with some butter. Nice chunk of butter. And then I like to go in with some minced garlic. I'm running out. I actually got to get more. I go shopping this week, so I'll be fine. Boom. Three spoons of minced garlic. And then basically you just season it the way you want. I use basically the same seasonings as I did on the salmon. Total. Season that baby up. Put a little sprinkle of adobo. Boom. No salt, we're trying the to top. So, our greens can smoke cook. Let's go ahead and put that with the bowl. Slow. Let's check on our salmon. Look at our salmon. It's doing amazing. Let me try to get y'all back on the right angle. There we go. Perfect. Stay right there, y'all. Stay right there. So I'm going to turn up the heat a little bit. I'm actually going to flip it now. Flip that baby. And then I just let that cook on a medium flame. I'm gonna put the top back on. And yeah, we're gonna let it do its magic. And let me check the rice and then I'll be back. Let's check the rice. Let's see, can we get an angle on the rice? Nope, we can't really get an angle on the rice, y'all. Oh yeah, a little bit, a little bit of an angle. Just mix that up. See, the pot is already getting hot. Just mix that up. This rice is already cooked. I don't know if I told y'all that. It's already cooked. So, all you gotta do is heat it up. As I said, you can use a microwave, but I don't own a microwave, and I prefer not to just because of all that radiation and stuff like that going into your food every time you want to heat something up. I mean, if I don't eat something fresh and hot, I can just always heat it right back up in a pan. Simple and easy. Now, um, 
let's just stir up the greens. So I don't flip it until I see a crisp. your green beans you have your brown rice served with some salmon this Wookie's plate I'm showing y'all Wookie's plate first because her plate looks way more beautiful than mine and this is my plate where I have some burnt garlic <laughs> I have some burnt garlic because I love the little like you know when you scrape the end of the pan when you finish cooking and it's a little crusty or whatever I love that it just adds more flavor to my whole meal so yeah you guys this is how you make a healthy luxury meal for under ten dollars like y'all stop playing go get your can of vegetables a little pack of brown rice and um pack of salmon you can get any type of fish you want i mean some salmon some some whiting some tuna some cod i mean whatever you want um and whatever vegetable you like go ahead y'all and get your grub on the healthy way the cheap way okay i love you all so much thank you all for watching and i'll see you all in my next video my babies peace and love bye Hey y'all, so I am going to be unboxing my new UGG rain boots and y'all, I don't know, like, I don't know if I've been under a rock or something, but I didn't really know that UGG had rain boots. <laughs> um, the last rain boots that I had was the Hunter rain boots and um, I really loved the Hunter rain boots, but I had them for so many years and they just, man, they just, um, became in such bad condition so i ended up throwing them out last year so it was really time for me to get some new rain boots so i was on the um UGG website right on when i was on the UGG website um new year's eve and i came across a rain boot y'all so we're going to be unboxing them and um yeah then i'll give you guys the name of them the price the color the size and all of that so let's get into the Unboxing. Such a light. Okay. See, they have the UGG logo right there. Just like UGGs, they do have the UGG logo on the bottom. But for the most part, they are sleek black. I got them in the size nine, because that is my size. And the name of these rain boots is the Sienna rain boots. And if you look inside of the rain boot, they actually have the same fur that is inside of your Uggs. So how dope is that? I mean, I haven't tried them on yet. 
<laughs> um, Wookie tried them on and she said they are so soft. So I love that detail of the boot because y'all know how much us ladies and guys, like we love Uggs because of the comfort and the warm comfiness of the boot. So um, yeah, now I got that same comfiness and warmness to my rain boots. So I really love that. Let's go ahead and open the other boot. So this is how they come packaged, all nice. Um, same detail, same exact detail. These are the boots. So yeah, I got them in a size nine. They are the mid-length boots. So they're not ankle rain boots and they're not the knee-high rain boots. They are mid. So they come up to um, like the middle of my leg, you know? So I love that because my last boots were the knee-high rain boots, my hunter boots, they were knee-high. So now I have the mid-length rain boots. And I just love them, you guys. I can't wait to wear them. Again, they're in a size nine. Um, this is how they look in the inside with the comfiness of the Ugg. It's also in the rain boots. I'm actually going to be getting Wookie a pair as well. They have kid sizes as well. Um, I'll probably get her a pink color or some type of pop color. But for me, I just went for the classic sleek black color. Um, but yeah. So yeah, I got them in a size black. They're called the Sienna rain boots. Um, also, talking about the price, they go for $85, but I actually got them for $45, you guys, because I had a $25 uh, coupon from UGG from my latest purchases from them. So when I went to check out, I, I actually forgot that I had the $25 off coupon because... <laughs> I don't know. Like, I don't be keeping up with my coupons. I know that's crazy because I be I could be saving money when I shop, but I'm just, I don't know, y'all. I don't keep up with that. <laughs> I just make the purchase and go on with my life. But yeah, so they was 85 and I was planning on paying the 85 at checkout. And then it was like, you have a coupon available for $25 off. Do you want to use it now? So um, I used it and guess what, you guys? I ended up only paying $45 for my new UGG. Uh, rain boots so yeah shout out to Ugg and I'm just so happy with my purchase and I hope you guys like them as well um I think they have like gray um a few other colors I think but I just wanted black again I got them in a size nine I'm sure they're gonna fit me nice and comfortable and snug and warm and yeah I just love my new boots so yeah all right y'all okay y'all I'm back <laughs> also um, I did buy a new wig, you guys. So this is the wig that I bought. The brand is Free Tress and Full Cap. Um, the style is New York Girl, and I got it in the color one, um, which is like jet black. So yeah, you guys, this is my new wig. I'm not gonna try it on for y'all right now. Oh yeah, it was $27.99. Of course, it's a synthetic wig. I'm just kind of bummed out a little bit because um, I can't apply heat to it, so it's just gonna have to be um, the best it's gonna be. And then if it starts getting like knotted or whatever, then I'm just I'm gonna be done with it because I'm not gonna be walking around here looking nuts. But um, yeah, I'm not <laughs> going to be trying this wig on for you guys today because um, I'm actually doing a content video and then I'm going to be wearing the wig. So you guys are going to just have to stay tuned to my next content video to see how your girl Raya J looks with her new wig. And um, yeah, and just let me know if you like this style on me um, or if you like my wave, my curly, my curly wig that I that I have. If you like like curls better on me, um, just comment down below what kind of style you think looks better on me, like a straight style or a curly, or um, if I should be a bit more risk taking and try different colors. I did see a cute ombre black and red wig. It was so cute, y'all, and it was like curl like a loose. No, it was like curly. It was like a curl like a wet and wavy style um, wig. It was much longer than this. Um, yeah, and I think I'm gonna go with that next. I'm not sure, man, because when I go wig shopping, y'all, it's so overwhelming for me. Like, 
as a Libra, I'm very indecisive. I can get really overwhelmed with too many options. So y'all, <laughs> I was having anxiety in that store. But um, yeah, I don't know y'all, but yeah, this is the new wig y'all. So just stay tuned for the next content video. It is going to be a sit down chit chat video with you guys. And um, yeah, we're going to be getting into some things. And um, yeah, I'm gonna be updating you guys on a few things in my life. And yeah, so by the time y'all see this clip, y'all would have watched the under $10 luxury healthy meal that I put together. Um, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys like some inspiration, like for those of you who may not have a lot of money or you don't know where to start as far as like a healthier diet, um, you can simply buy some simple brown rice from the supermarket with a can of vegetables of your taste and buy um, some salmon and whip that baby together and there you go you have a healthy luxury meal for under ten dollars you guys i literally eat this meal like almost every day because me and my daughter are obsessed with salmon um <laughs> so yeah and then you guys have seen my new uh grain boots which i love i'm so in love y'all um and yeah, now y'all see my new wig. So this is the end of the content video, my babies. I love you all so much. And thank you all for watching. And I'll see you all in my next video. And if you made it this far in the video, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment down below and subscribe to your girl Raya J's channel so you can keep up with the newest content on my channel. And don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you know when your girl Raya J posts new content. I love you guys so much. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you all in my next video. Peace and love. Bye. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we just found out that Pinky died, and we cried. Uh, I knew something was wrong with Pinky because she was just floating at the bottom of the tank, and um, I realized it. And I asked Wookie, is she okay? You know, was she doing this? And she looked it fine. I just, I guess we had opened the window to film the Shein haul. And I guess it was just too cold for her and then we left the window open. So it just, all of that just was a bad combination for Pinks. And cause she was fine this morning. She's been fine. I guess, only thing I can think of is is us having the window open so everybody say bye to pinky we're gonna flush pinky down the toilet we cried it's really emotional for us y'all know we haven't even had her for a month so we love you pinks and we will never forget you inshallah say bye pinky and love you pinky Okay, bye pinks.